In a recent development, the director of an upcoming MCU film has dropped a bombshell. It's going to be rated R, making it only the second movie in the franchise to earn this mature rating, alongside Deadpool 3. This marks a significant shift in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, known for its family-friendly fare, as it begins to explore more mature and edgy narratives. Historically, the MCU has predominantly stuck to PG-13 ratings, with the notable exceptions of the Deadpool films. However, as the MCU evolves and introduces new characters and stories, we're now witnessing a shift toward more adult content, evident in Disney Plus S Echo, which recently received a TV Ma rating, equivalent to an R rating for television. Many fans expected that Deadpool 3 would be the lone R-rated entry in the MCU, given its established mature tone. However, in an interview with Deadline, the director of the upcoming Blade film, Yen Demange, confirmed that Marvel Studios has given him the green light for an R rating, which is a welcome relief for him. He emphasized the importance of this rating, and he's clearly enthusiastic about the project, particularly because he'll be collaborating with the talented Mahershala Ali whom he described as a deep actor. Demange also provided a tantalizing glimpse of what fans can expect in Blade. He mentioned that Ollie's character will exude ruthlessness and roughness, which suggests a violent and intense portrayal of the vampire hunter. I'm excited to showcase his ruthlessness and the rough edges he possesses, allowing him to navigate the world in a distinctive manner. I admire his dignity and integrity, but beneath the surface, there's a ferocity waiting to be unleashed. I want to bring that to the screen. The decision to give Blade an R rating is justified. Unlike most superhero films, Blade's character deals with mature supernatural themes and sequences that require a more mature approach. Marvel Studios could have played it safe and aimed for a PG-13 rating, but that would likely compromise the final product. Blade, as a vampire hunter, is inherently brutal, and maintaining the character's ruthlessness and aggression is crucial. If Deadpool 3 warranted an R rating due to Wade Wilson's colorful language, then Blade deserves the same rating to fully capture the relentless and violent nature of Eric Brooks. This decision to embrace the R rating for Blade reflects Marvel's commitment to delivering authentic and compelling narratives that resonate with the character's core essence. It's a bold move that promises a fresh and intense take on the superhero genre, and fans can't wait to see Marshala Ali embody the iconic vampire hunter. Till I get up, time is barely on our side